This program is brought to you by Mental Atom Products Deep Heat and Deep Freeze and Willie McLernan at Farmer Otter Care, official sponsors of East Kilbride FC TV. Well, the away fans are here. Is this today the East Kilbride win the Lone League? It is Civil Service Strollers away for Kelby. The Strollers have been a credit to the Lone League, have uh, fitted in to the acclimatisation period and they're looking to go stronger next campaign. But Kelby, it's all about winning the league title. Let's look at the sides and first of all, the home team managed by Graham Robertson. They do have one or two players that can be deadly, likes of Churchill, Finney and Boyle in the final third. David Stewart can leather a penalty. A bit light on the bench with two trialists involved today. We'll see if they can impress for the home side. Sun is out. It is a glorious day. And for Kelby, Matt McGinley is the goalkeeper. Barry Russell, captain in that side. It is Howie and Proctor the back two. Colin Gibbons have been excellent of late, as is Strachan, winter, all season they've been great. Paul Woods has fitted in superbly and it's him and McLean, the two up top today. And the bench has the likes of McNeil and Victoria can add extra quality in that final third, plus others on the sidelines. Out come the sides. And it's a bit like the walk out of the Crystal Dome. This is an intriguing little walk from changing rooms to the pitch. It is, as I say, a really beautiful day. Nice to have our mascot there too. As the two captains go through all the formalities. Big day for East Kilbride. Will they win the league at the Strollers? Off we go. Kelby get us going in the red and white today. Along it goes. It's been given away here. Newell. Nice exchange of passes, but over it goes from Finney. They've just opened up a little bit, killed me from the mistake. More time to slid in by Campbell, the early sub, but. Giving away. Now it's the roving run of Adam Strachan. Going all the way by himself. Woods. Into a good area and it's cleared away. Such an open game. Missing the chase on. Finney won't quite reach that. Only pass this for Strachan, and he's got plenty of time, really enough of the fast zippy game. Still going here, and he goes down. Challenge from Churchill, and the penalty's been given, says the referee. Well, I'm not sure if there entirely was contact here. There was a swipe. I think there was a bit of a clumsy slip as well from Strachan. If there was contact, then you can see why the penalty possibly a bit soft. No mistake from the penalty spot from Sean Winter. The big day for East Kilbride. 19th minute, they have the lead. Is this the nerve settler? Might well have been a fortuitous penalty, but it's a confidently taken penalty. No chance for the goalkeeper. And Sean Winter makes it 1 0. Long it goes, looking here for Woods. Twist and turn, trying to get away from Laird. 
Strachan just superb. And McLean with the second effort has blocked away. It's a short corner routine. And a good try. Gibbons getting the piece from Martin Lachlan. A fast paced game, not too many clear cut chances, but Kelby looking to bounce and get the second. And absolutely terrific run, and this is. And Winter is going to put it over Woods with a great drive, but Winter couldn't put it in the net. Barntine for Dingwall. Not quite fine Churchill, but they do have it back. Dingwall trying to deliver it in. And the strike is always whistling wide from Stewart. Free kick time. Parried away by Burnside. Wood's not giving up on it. They have to settle for the throw. Strachan was the one that took it in the end, the free kick. Now the switch from the strollers. High it goes, really towering. That's not going to come to anything. And that'll do for the first half. And the penalty from Winter, I think, for two to the given. But Winter will take it. Are the champions elect going to be champions in 45 minutes time? It's 1-0. Stroller getting us underway for the second half. Have they got an upset in store? Forward from McGinley, who's the, the cap on. McLean looking to nest himself away. It's another penalty. Robbie Laird. A little slide and shove, I think, by the looks of it. McLean using his strength to try and get away. Again, it's clumsy from the strollers. And this may well put the game to bed from Sean Winter. Into the 51st minute. Is this for 2 0? Sean Winter, a bit of a delay in the take, and it's saved. This time by Burnside. Sean Winter's penalty denied. It was a cracking save from the keeper at full stretch. It was heading towards that left corner. Keeper read it well. In fairness. And the strollers still in the game. It remains 1-0. Now they've got the corner here. Kelby taken by Burnside. Maybe going to try and catch Kelby out. The challenge comes in, but play on. Campbell did well, riding the challenges. Newell. And now it's a penalty at the other end. Goodness me. What a turnaround. It's caught with the infringement. Yeah, it's clumsy. It's David Stewart. It's 1 1. McGinley went the wrong way. And 90 seconds or so, the turnaround for Nikki's penalty save. Stewart converts. It's a brilliant penalty. And the civil service draws on level terms. It's going to be a blatter of a free kick, but well past that post. From Colt. Big injection and change of pace. Oh, that's frustration. Look at the frustration from Paul Woods. Throw in McLean. Oh, just in the side netting. Barry Russell then. Up long. Proctor looking around, Howie in there too, looking for this goal. Strachan, they're all working around in there. 
Shrakens effort over the bar. Long in from Russell. Victoria, the sub, trying to influence it. New York gets in the way. It's Capuano. Dive towards goal. Is there space? Is there a turn? I think was that how in there? I'm not entirely sure. The scramble under the sun haze. Russell forward. Sliced away. Anywhere will do. Strohs will take a point. Ballantyne trying to get forward. Yiki supporters on their feet. End to end. Title may go on for another week. And now the challenge coming in. Yellow card for Gibbons. And that is game over. And the title won't be won today. Handshakes, civil service throwers played well in the game. But the tale of the missed penalty from Sean Winter early in the second half, within less than a couple of minutes, the strollers equalised to a penalty of their own. And a draw, maybe the fair result in the reflection of the game. EK never took one or two chances. The strollers really came into it as the game went on, despite the late siege. So full time, 1-1. One, one. And, well, it was looking a bit dicey for East Stirlingshire, but they got the job done in the end. 4-2 away at Hoycroft Albert. Elsewhere win for Cumrall Colts in there. Edinburgh University away, Selkirk away. Draw between Spartans and Gallifrey Rovers. And there was also wins for University of Stirling and BSC Glasgow on the road at Vale of Leith in a big 6-2 win. So the table, East Kilbride are almost there, but they're going to have to wait to Gallifrey Rovers next weekend to see if they can get over the line. But 69 points, it is looking good, but there is tough games to come. Spartans, East Stirlingshire ahead, so they'd like to get it done quicker, sooner rather than later. A civil service stroller, as you see there in 12th, very much safe, and they have had a solid season acclimatising to the Lone Lake. So, Gallifrey Rovers away. Next up, that is the game. Three points will clinch the title. All the action on EKFC TV.